I made this song in response to Nobi making Consequence. It was on a feel good type vibe. <laughs> but listen to the break. Like, I wrote this. I really, you know who I wrote this for though? Lord, I'm not going to lie to you. I wrote this because I had, the people don't know. I, Black and Mile, I can tell you. I used to go to Black and Mile studio and like just write stuff for people and just come up with concepts and ideas. I'm a good person when it comes to shit like that. And so I can hear it for the book, but this song was really for Shab off the air. Cause he, I had already did it, I had already wrote for him a song called Hollywood. I don't know if y'all remember that one. It's kind of like on the same line. I'm gonna play Hollywood too, and y'all hear what I'm saying, but that Hollywood New Orleans says, oh, I wrote that for Shab. Shab was my, was my real life partner back then. I don't, like, Shab used to, uh, I, I really was fucking with Shab because Shab was messing with this dude from Thibodeau in the country, in case y'all don't know, my mama lived there. So I really met Shab before he was in the start bouncing. Oh, uh, I forgot the dude's name. I want to say his name, Ronnie Paul. But that's a whole nother story for a whole nother day. We'll get to that in a minute. But um, I wrote this for Shaft. And so I actually recorded the blurbs. Sometimes instead of just writing it, I just record it so they can see how it's supposed to sound. And it just come to, come to wind out, uh, Black, and my, Black and My released it. And that's, that became my song. Because I'm not really a bouncing artist. I'm an MC. That's the difference than an artist and an MC. I don't make songs. I don't have to make a song. I'm shit. <laughs> but uh, let me play the song. But if you, uh, like, this is it's very similar I'm to the song. Ooh, ah, what's that song? Song? Material, girl, like to Ooh, ah, what's that song? Material girls like to do it face down. Ooh, ah, what's that song? Material girls like to do it face down. Dolce Gabbana. Bibi Madonna. Gucci and Prada. Louis Vuitton. Oh my lord, ride up, who's for your better massacre? I bring diamond, nation, 
work is done. Hey, Mr. Two, you gotta take your pose. You got to make sure you're tight for them jealous hoes. Hey, Mr. Two, you got to work for me. You got to pop ticky ticky when you get that beat. Come on, Mr. Four, you got to show that for a thousand dollar hot material, girl. Camel, 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 Nobody wants to listen to that old bounce music. I, I, I used to, I really went been the pull over for a twerk break, okay? I really can't, I don't like my voice. <laughs> like, I cannot stand the sound of it when it comes on recordings. I hated that. All right, so I'm going to play this song because I can't find the other one. But this is Double Dribble. This is the only time... I did a song with you. And this is the oldest of motherfuckers. They got 300,000 views on this bitch. They're 14 years old. I should release this on Apple Music. Oh. 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 Other song first. <laughs> but this is the point I get.
that started off. All right. I hated him. I hated him at the time. I could not stand Norby. Norby, because Norby was beefing with me for nothing. Norby just thought I had aspirations of taking over what he was doing. But I only had aspirations to be the MC. I never had aspirations to be the artist. I'm not good as an artist. I cannot rap. I hate going to the studio. I used to dread going to the studio. But before Material Girls, my biggest dread going to the studio recording. Because I, I miss the live energy. Like, I'm in, like, I really believe to this day. Shout out to Trophy Chalker. Outside of that, I really believe nobody can fuck with me on the mic live. Nobody. I don't think nobody can. If I'm feeling that you're dead, you're not going to be nobody. That's including the best ever live. Now, in the studio, I just, I can hear it, but I just, I don't know, I just can't get past it. And so I never wanted to be an artist, but, and so I came out, so this is what I would do. I would go into the studio, say one or two words, bitch, and get the fuck out. Y'all better mix it up and do some spectacular shit, because I'm tired, I'm not going to do it. And being a queen, girl, I never wanted to do that. But I can hear, so anyway, so one time, Frida was in the studio doing working for doing some stuff with Blazer. And so um I was just giving pearls about maybe you should say it like this and maybe you should say that like this. And so um she liked it. And so that's how we kind of got whatever, whatever. And I actually started MC first. She's like, people think I don't like her, but that's not true. I might not like her man, but and that's a whole nother story for a whole nother thing. But as far as her, I really, I don't really, y'all be thinking, I don't hate on Frida. I think I, people can oh shaking the bullet and all this stuff like that. Whatever. That's not true. But I've, I've actually, if you paid attention, I've given this girl much respect before. And said that I, the, the the levels and bars that she stepped for bounce, I never saw nobody bounce doing. I've always said that. I'm saying you can and anybody that fuck with me know I'll be like, bitch, that's the queen. I might be the number two sister in New Orleans, but the number one is gonna be Freddie Rose. Nah, you know what I'm saying? It's not like everybody hate on her. And I ain't gonna lie, me and her never had a bad relationship. Last time I saw her, she was in uh Gator Gator Bay. And she come out at me everything. I mean, and I don't have a problem with her. I mean, I you know, musically, I don't but I've always stated the truth though, and people just take this as hate. But the truth is, the best bounce artist has always been Sissy Nova. Part of that male, female, sissy, dyke, whatever you wanna call it. Nobody's better than know. And a lot of the opportunities for to have, that's really supposed to be nobody opportunities, but I mean I'm not the I don't the chips where they fall at. But nonetheless, 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 nonetheless. So I've always given her her props. I've never really hate I and it's being truthful. I don't think she's the best artist. But I think she's probably the best. She has a great business mind. And that's always gonna carry you in the music business. Hello. So this is the so the song. This was so, so this song, I was really throwing a lot of shade at Nobi. Nobi had a song called uh so I had gotten Nobi MySpace. MySpace was a thing back then. I got Nobi MySpace page deleted, bitch. But go, good day. And so, girl, me and Nobi was fighting, girl, when we see each other. Girl, it was so much shit going on, girl. It was so much shit. <laughs> it was so much shit, girl. It was bitch back in the gap. But see, back in the gap, we had to worry about nothing. There was no shit that bounced. Now, you might fight bounce. You gonna get bopped. But you nowadays, the hoes is shooting and cutting. Back then, we would just bop each other. But Norman actually lost her eye from somebody cutting her. But that's the whole, this is before then. This is predating that. Or was it predating that? I don't remember. But no, 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 no. Because I used to, I used to, I used to jones all about that one eye. I remember when she got that eye cut. Girl. I wasn't, I don't know. I'm going to say that's a whole other story for a whole other thing. But, um, so the soul was throwing shade at Nobi because Nobi, <laughs> we was beefing over a trade. Not the seven war child. That's one. We was beefing over the chat room because I was the MC and he was the artist in the chat room and Hassan was like the opening act. We had a nice little, I'm thinking, Hassan, let me tell you something. What you had at the chat room in 2000 motherfucking six, seven and all that stuff like that. You had me as the host, the MC. You had Blazer as the DJ and DJ Randy the King. You had Sissy Noby as the headliner and you had Hot Sizzle as the opening act. Bitch, the hoes in the chat room, if you were in the chat room 100 pounds, if you were in the chat room 200 pounds, bitch, it was coming out 100. Bitch, I'm not lying. Bitch, bitch, you had, bitch, you had a motherfucking show. I swear to God, you had tell-offs in the motherfucking chat room. Shout out to Hot Sizzle, shout out to Sissy Noby, R.I.P. Blazer, shout out to Randy the King, and shout out to my motherfucking self, bitch. 
But Norman always thought I wanted his job. <laughs> I don't want to be the headliner. I want to be the MC. That's what I want to do. That's what I want to do. I want to rap over the mixes and get the keep the crowd into it till you get your chance to come and make them wiggle till they can't wiggle them. That's the perk. That's how we work in this. Like, I don't know what in his mind told him that I was his competition. You have competition in other people. You have competition in people that are artists. But I think what the problem became is when I started a record company and started signing artists. And so, that was the issue. But I was so polarizing, and he was very polarizing, that it was like it just became a, a problem. And so we started being, for, 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 and we, supposed to be on, we could have been on the same team. But I, I don't think he could have started. Anyway, long story short, that's how this song hit when I put a plate at it, got into it. Because he made a song called Give Me My Space. Uh, no, he, yeah, I took his mind to so I made a song called Give Me My Space. Hold on. Yeah, the fall from scary. It's all give out nobody, but it's a shoe fist wearing. <laughs> So I so Norman didn't graduate and I was just I did. But um I was on his ass like I was being shady because I didn't been shady girl. I was throwing all kinds of lists. So that's so, so what I'm saying. So as the lyrics say in the song. <laughs> So I'm throwing so much shit at Norman, but I couldn't, that bitch had, he threw shit at Norman. Shoe fist wearing, got high real fast and your hoes can't take it. Jealous cause a nigga been graduated. So fake, so phony, so foolish, and shoot. I'm up there, tell it cause I'm never wearing a shoe. So fast, it's a hot number one, you ever see. Camel sample from Break It Down and say, everybody say, Break It Down. I don't want nobody else to hear the song. I want it so out in a song. <laughs> Oh, you 
the mic and the beat contract. Now be on time, you always are with us. Shade too, and song, and everything too. And girl, when I tell you what that bitch did, this is how she whooped me, girl, because she just kept dropping hits. In that day and age, every song Nobi had dropped, bitch, was a motherfucking hit, bitch. I can't even lie to you, and I'm saying that with all due respect and honesty, bitch. I know I had, listen, I had signed to me. I said it was my brother. Me and him was to be so tight, girl. We was even dressing alike. This is how fucking co close we were. Me and him was to be dressed alike. So I had high sizzle on my team. We was under the same label called uh, Warner Cut Records. Bitch. I had motherfucking Guy Boy Chris, Elm Boy Payne, all of them signed to me. Uh, Blazer, Pikachu, D uh, uh, it, girl, you name Uptown. You name it, bitch. They was they was signed to me. Oh, fuck with me, some sign to Bitch, when I tell you. I'm here. What's up? What's up, next individuals? When I tell you, bitch, that whole Nobu was a one man, but had nothing but himself, bitch. That bitch was a one man army, bitch. I swear to God, I say that with all due fucking respect, bitch. I say that with all due fucking respect, bitch. And that's just giving her her fucking moves. That that bitch Nobu was a one man motherfucking record crew, bitch. That bitch Nobu ain't playing no game. That whole drop a song that ain't was supposed to be a hit, bitch. And that bitch just blow up, bitch. The whole was fucking with that bitch no. I do not know what the entire fuck happened. Because in them day and age, all you heard was no. You didn't nobody else. There was no Frida. Kata was kind of like not feeling it anymore. You didn't hear no motherfucking Really, be honest, no vodka. You hear something from our camp, but that was it. They didn't, nobody really redefined what bounce music was for males, females, and everything. The only person was making noise, I'm gonna say, be honest with you, on the same level as Nobi, but just wasn't with the consistency, was Shardy. Because Shardy was going into real rap and bounce rapping. And most of the, like, you know what I'm saying? So she'll go into her real, like, so. But I don't never put them into competition, but Shawty used to give Nobel a run for her money when it comes like just shows and stuff like that. But other than that, girl, there was nobody. There was nobody. It was Nobi. It was Nobi. And that's just saying they all don't respect it. Just being real, bitch. That's just being real. You can't get no real into that, bitch. I, I had to be shaky. People want to know the name of that stuff. Oh, that song name was Get In, Get Out by MC Shaky. Yeah. But if, if it was a Nobi or something from my camp, it was short and that was it. There was nothing else. All that shit didn't exist. But you know, I think, so, all right. So in the case of the camps though, see, I like black. I fuck with black and my own. I always have. I never had, some people, I just, I never got in an argument with Blazer. I never got in an argument with black and my own. I never had no issues with none of them. I, so, but my loyalty was always with the people I fuck with every day, and that was Blazer. So I really couldn't go fuck with Black and Mild and like that. But Black and Mild, you know, I, sh I always show love, and you know, I ain't gonna lie to you. Like he, if like, I ain't gonna lie. Black and them, they little camp. Cause so Black had fuck with Shorty and Freedom. So this is why you hear anytime Black and Mild make a song for one of them big artists, that's his go-to, Freedom and Shorty. That's his go-to. He gonna always put them on a the thing. But, um, girl, all I can say, girl, is this, for real. My new song, what new song? I got a new song. I have a new song. <laughs> when did I get a new song? I, didn't, I don't have a new song. I, have, I haven't recorded in, a, in over a year. Thank you. It's like a little turquoise kind of blend mix. I was going for a blue. I did not succeed like I wanted to succeed, but, you know. 
to go see. Girl, the whole is outside, bitch, for the essence, bitch. But, um, so, it's like, girl, so we got a motherfucking, so I have to, um, I know you're talking real life shit, but when you get off, I'm going to send you pictures from my grand and touch you. Okay, cool. The bounce body, I'm going to mix it up. Watch me. Just hear with it. Okay. But girl, it's just, it was like, that's just with all due respect. I don't know how Nobi, Nobi have to be one of the most talented people I have met in my life. And I have met all kinds of celebrities and everything. And she has to be one of the most talented bitches. I have ever met my entire whole life. And that's just being real. I don't think I've never met somebody just 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 pure, pure talent like no. I don't think I've ever had. Just pure talent, bitch. I got to give him his props. Nobody got to be just pure talent. Just like with no, not even trying. Just pure detail, bitch. How he be doing it, I do not know. But that bitch be doing it. That bitch got some, like just out of his, just oozing down it, bitch. But girl, that's why I don't even know, I don't know what happened, girl. I ain't lying to you. In my mind, just, I think nobody should have also been at least as equally yoked as with Frida and with Frida. Why you say nobody is so talented? Girl, nobody has had the more hits. Listen, nobody had the most hits. Listen, nobody had the most hits. The most hits. The most longevity bounce career. The most hits just hit than anybody in bounce music history. Nobody has had hits everywhere you can have a hit. Nobody has to have hits as a motherfucking, as the artist, as a feature, as a producer, as a mixer, as a, everywhere you can have a hit, nobody's had a hit and bounce music. Alive? What are you talking about? Nobody can say that. Nobody can say that besides nobody. Nobody can say that. I come close. Can I be in a car? I don't like to, I don't go live from my house. Or I don't go live from my mom's house. Because, yes, I'm in New Orleans. Is that a problem? Anonymous, hold on, baby. Come on, come on. Stop, 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 stop. Pause, pause, pause. Back up. Before you just start doing it. I'm talking about that. I'm, out, I'm outside for Essence. I'm trying to find a parking spot, bitch. Because let me see how far I got to walk to where I'm going, girl. Because it's, I don't, I'm at, cause I, it don't look like I can be close at all. And so I might park there, but I know the parking there is so fucking high. Which, it's going to be a billion dollars, bitch. I'm not trying to pay that. Belly fucking dude, Jesus. You big, big, pretty lips, girl. I can see my pussy. Oh, did I say that out loud? <laughs> so, anyway, well, I got to give him his props, bitch. That bitch know me something serious. Yeah, girl, billion dollars. Let me see how far it is from the. Oh, girl. I'm like, one, two, three, four, five, six blocks, girl. You know, man. <laughs> My fat is not walking the motherfucking six blocks, bitch. I will walk two. For this TV show boosted her, you have to have person that has that big time as well. Probably so. What's going on, Bam Louise? What's up, King's Ray? Girl. Mother can't do such a shit in shape on not, girl. I'm so sick of them, girl. I will walk two. I walked in 30, bitch. <laughs> Not happening. 
So I got to find something to hit, even if it is a hundred billion dollars, bitch. I got to pay this because, bitch, it's too hot. I'm too big and I'm too black, bitch. It don't go together, bitch. I got the pump where I got to get where I live. I'm not waking up where I live right now. <clears throat> Just waking up. <laughs> I can't do it, girl. I walk in a motherfucking six motherfucking blocks, girl. In this heat, hot as it is, bitch, no man. Uh-uh. Girl, no man. I walk to. They're lucky they get mad. Lucky to get that shit, cause I'm not doing that. I'm trying to see if I can curve if I can. I'm trying to think I can suck the park, bitch. <laughs> if I can get it for that, bitch, y'all know I'm a cheap bitch. Six blocks in the heat for like three miles, you ain't never lie. The generation totally different. Now listen, let me say this though. <clears throat> I like the new generation. I do. I do. But I think they, I think a lot of times the new generation get in their own way. I'ma just say that, y'all can take that how you want. I'm not saying a particular to nobody. But nothing be stopping them, but they get in their own way. And if they get out their own way, they'll be a lot more bigger and they'll be a lot more and bounce up here on a whole different level. If they get out their own way. And and that's not me talking about nobody. That's not me saying a particular person. That's not nothing. That's just me saying the new generation really get in their own way. And I don't understand that for nothing. And let's not go get Candace, have her drop me off and then come pick me up. That's what I might do. That might be the, that might be the answer. Cause bitch, I can't see no parking spot. Is this a parking spot? No, this is a fucking big the No parking. I'll park this. Fuck it. <laughs> I'm about two blocks away now. But I, you know, just I just think, oh, they got a boot on there. Uh, I bet not, girl. Cause they, you want to do me a favor, girl? What? I would. Could you come? I'm gonna have you have to come. You have to come drive me off and then pick me up because I can't find a parking spot, girl. And I'm not walking no eight, nine, six blocks. I'm not walking two blocks to be honest. With you. And I see nothing but them putting boots on people's cars and everything. So I need to. And I'm not gonna pay no eight and nine hundred dollars and stuff to park. Could you come drive me off and then just pick me up when I call you? Okay, um... You ain't got to put nothing yeah. on. I just need you to drive me off at the, um... Where I'm going. No, I was accident leaving out. Oh, shit. Right. Okay. I'm I'm over here, but I'm in traffic right now. All right, don't worry about it. I'm going to see some more. I'm going to call you. Where you going? No, um... I could have... I'm huh? just trying to tell you what I'm about the snowball thing. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> I'm, all right. You leaving out right now? Yeah, I'm actually in the truck. Okay, that's fine. Okay, all right. Because, right. baby, huh, that's that's how you do it. All right. That's how you do it. Bitch, I'm not, uh-uh, girl, it's uh-uh. Mm -mm. I'm doing all that fucking walking, girl. Uh-uh, I need to. I need to. I'm not big ass. We can walk the six blocks. Bitch, I'm not. I am not, girl. Nope. <laughs> not, not I, says the king. <laughs> the snowball stand right up the street with it. <laughs> so, because uh, <laughs> I'm not doing it, girl. I'm certainly not doing it. So, yeah, what I was talking about, girl? Yeah, the, I think the new bounce artist should be a lot fun. I'm going to just say this. When I, like, like, let me see something. It's, 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 I can name right now six girl bounce artists that is better than any what's going on what's going on china doll so, so how you doing baby all right sir i can name six girl bounce artists that's better than anything that you hear from the city girls meg the stallion and all that other dick dick all, i can even though they do y'all think they do the same thing but I, i've been around them and they're really talented i can name six right now my daughter dino my daughter vine tree reed super bad vicky low all six of them is better than any of them girls there. I not say what I say. And I will put them up against, I will put them up against whomever. And they can out rap, out entertain. These girls would, I, I, I'd, have been, I'd have been around all of them in some capacity. 
uh, in some capacity. As y'all know, of course y'all know I've been around the Um, Y'all know, well, I actually met Reedy first out of all, all of them through Blazing, and I met super bad through Blazing. Vicky Lo, I kind of discovered. Really, nobody put me on Vicky Lo. Nobody been told me like Vicky Lo, Vicky Lo, Vicky Lo. And I didn't even know who she was, but then nobody put me on her. And I was like, okay, no, Vicky Lowe really got something. I had the opportunity to win. Vicky Lowe recorded, it's on my page if you go look at it somewhere. But when Vicky Lowe recorded her verse for Amazing Saint Stone, I was in the room actually just giving a little perno or two. Then Black Cat called me for that too. Um, and Superbad, I, like Superbad continues to surprise me. But, but uh, no shame. Blazer was very, very big on Superbad. I thought when I first met Superbad, she had the biggest attitude in the world. <laughs> and you, that could be cute. Sometimes, but uh, not super sense, super bad. Please don't do this. <laughs> yeah, so that's six girls right now I know are better. That's six girls right now from New Orleans that could I would put against any of them city girl all of because some city girls on this stuff can't rap. They just popular for real. Meg can rap. I'm not gonna give it to her, but Meg is so typecasting herself one type of thing. It's like she becoming that one type of one dimensional ass bitch. And I don't like that, but she can rap. Um, who else? Uh, you know, them big lottos and all them stuff like that, they always gonna be in the shadows. When you talk about Nikki, that's a whole different monster. I'm not comparing them to Nikki because Nikki is just a whole different thing. And when you talk about Cardi, I don't really think Cardi can rap no shade. I think she can, I don't even think she can fucking talk, really. And I know don't, don't get all the barbs and carbs and all them whatever y'all do. But I don't think they really like living like that. But um, I think that I think that all of them. <laughs> I wish my would shut up. Car not Carisha, but uh, they uh, you know that's just my opinion. There's no shame. There's no tea. I just really that's just my opinion about the whole matter. And my opinion is with my opinion. No matter what my opinion is, your opinion could be something different. That's my opinion. I don't think none of them fucking with them. I don't think none of them is really fucking with them six out of the world. And I don't, so the only answer could be is that they is getting in their own way. I don't know how to, I don't know the answer to that. I'm not that smart. But I can almost promise you it has something to do with the business acumen. I can almost promise you. I wish somebody would come and bring a show down here. <laughs> And just, just show Because we, we got girls out here that just For real eat And the energy Let me tell you something I, And I'm going to say something Listen I'm going to say okay When it comes to reading Right I think that Reading have a good Like first of all Her voice is sick Just period This is Girl I'm telling y'all This is Her voice is sick just, it have a such I haven't heard a voice that even emulate that since probably Shorty. So she blessed with that. And then Reedy, she really have a, a punk mentality. Like it's so cold blooded. She all woman, but she really have that punk mentality when it's coming to her, how she's spitting it, how she giving her stuff. Treaty, I think, is the total package. No shit, I got to give her a props. She got the look. She got the presence. She got the motherfucking. She got lyrics. She's more of the lyrical style too. No shade. Got to give her her props. Oh my god. Dino, by far out of the the best. Like listen, when Dino became my daughter, the first day I saw her live in person, she gave me chills. How she performs, it's like she. My bad. Who I was on. It's back. Who I was on? What's the last person y'all heard me talk about? What's up, these colonists? Girl, I still ain't come get my thing, girl. I need to come get this pussy clean, girl. What's up, sister? Dino. All right. Dino is... Dino... Dino give me chills how she performs. Her performance game not to be <laughs> messed with. I'm sorry. If you think you got outperformed, you know you got another motherfucking thought coming. Viney is a pure D entertainer. She do not care. She'll get you into that show. She'll, she'll throw that mic down, start dancing. She'll just really get you into that show. Um, Vicky Lowe, I think, is probably one of the 
just best lyricist? Bar none. <laughs> you didn't just say that. That's what I said. Oh, treaty? Treaty total package. Treaty total package. The look, the stage presence, the girl. Our girls is beating them girls any day of the week, girl. And motherfucking super bad girl, I, I'm just like, I think that, I think super bad, like, super bad is a rapper, but I think she meant to be something else, like, as far as just might be rea reality TV slash something, because she just, she just something on a, she on a different level, but, but I'm gonna tell you where I think, so I don't know what the problem is, if I had a camera, what's up, I need to do this though, I really need to do this. Not if I had a camera, I just need to motherfucking have a motherfucking. I should. This is what I should do. I should. I should do a fucking show called Queens of Our Speech and just get all of them and put them on one show. They, but listen, let me say something, girl. Who child? No mind. Take that back, girl. Cause this is what I don't like doing. <laughs> no mind. I take that back. But I'ma just say this, like I said, them, like ain't nobody beating our girls and I'm saying what the fuck I say I don't think they got a city out there to have a girls or nothing and I'm not being shady to nobody but and and, and they because it's because they all come all of them people that's making it in the industry bite the girls down his style so that's the point I don't get they really like all they fucking songs it be something that they done heard down here or something that's coming rearranged and reacclimated to whatever they doing and it's always the shit that these girls be on ahead of time. Yeah, Super Bear ready for TV tomorrow, bitch. I'm sorry. She is hilarious. If you just like, if you just be around, girl, she just she's very she's entertaining. But girl, it's like all of them have something, and I don't know what why the problem is they get in their own way. I can't explain it. But if girl, if they had like if I had a tenth of the talent and shit that they have. Girl, I'll be a quadrillionaire, quadrillionaire, bitch. I have looked at that epic panel you had, and if you had a show, it would be fire. No, I wouldn't. I, I, I don't even know how to do it, girl. I couldn't. I couldn't. I couldn't. Girl. I don't have it. I don't have it. I'm getting old. My head, girl, my head ain't been the fuck feeling, bitch, because you know, girl. They need to do it. They really need to do it. Because, bitch, that's what the world waiting on. For real. Oh, excuse me. Oh, that was oh, that bitch felt good. Oh, that was a good feeling, bitch, bitch. So much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. The truth. I'm trying to add them. They don't be added though. I guess we don't want to talk because we want to today. The truth don't hurt me. There's the truth or the other hole. That could never. The truth. How could the truth hurt? Is the truth. Oh, okay, that's the problem. Question like that, you must go live. You 
you ask the question, oh, you want to go live? How you going to ask the question like that and don't want to go live? If you ask the question like that, you want to go live. So you want, okay, hold up, hold up. You want to ask a personal question about my children, but you don't want to be seen? Make that make sense. You want to, how are you listening out here over here? You want to ask a personal question about my children, but you want you, but you don't want a person to be seen. Does that make sense? Does that make sense, sister? I don't want you to know who I am, but I want to know everything about you, and your and your kid. I want to know everything about you and your kid. But I don't want you to know who I am. So why you keep declining, sister? You ask the question. It's no shame. I'm just asking. That is weird. That's scary. That's scary. I have a right to know. Like you have a right to know about me because I elected to be on social media. But they didn't elect to be on social media. So if you don't know, that's probably a reason you don't know. But my question is, if you want to know, I want to know who you are to know about my kids. So and that should that should be a fair exchange. But if you don't want to come up, my sound bad. What's up, Tyrus? How you doing? I'm trying to see something. We need to come back. I ain't leaving. If I leave, I'm not coming back. Y'all hear me? Can y'all hear me? It's muffled. Hey, Lola. I'm on the Xbox. That's them right there. Oh, girl. All right, y'all. I love you. I'm going to talk to y'all later.